This is the Gator Frameworks Desk Mounted Pro Broadcast Mic Boom Arm. Here's a look at some of the specs. An XLR cable is included. It supports mics up to 3.5 pounds and includes desk mounts. Let's go ahead and pop it out of the box. And there it is. It's a closed tubular design and the 10 foot XLR cable is pre-installed and contained inside. So everything looks clean. A desk clamp is included. And this can be mounted two ways. A screw in desk mount is also included. The mic mount is 3 8 inch with a 5 8 adapter, so it's compatible with practically all mics and shock mounts. It's spring loaded with tension adjustment, so you can lock it down if you don't want the arm to move. And operation is practically silent. This arm easily accommodates microphones like the Shure SM7B, Rode Procaster, Rode Broadcaster, Shure SM58, condensers with shock mounts, etc. When compared with another very popular mic arm, the Rode PSA1, the frameworks looks a bit cleaner since it's not a scissor arm and the cable is contained within the arm. One thing I do like about the road arm is that it includes this in-desk mount. And if you already have one, you can use the frameworks arm with the road mount. Operation of both arms is very similar, except the frameworks has tension knobs and can hold mics up to around 3.5 pounds, while the road is rated for up to 2.4 pounds. Both of these are high quality mic arms and you'll probably be happy with either. The Frameworks is a bit more expensive, a little bit longer, and specifically with mics like the Shure SM7B, you'll have more side to side rotation available with the Frameworks because the road has these thumb screws on both sides and it hits the XLR plug. Of course, this is specific to the SM7B and wouldn't affect all mics, but it's worth being aware of. If you want to pick up either of these arms, we'll have Amazon affiliate links in the description below. So that is the Gator Frameworks Desk Mounted Pro Broadcast Boom Arm.